Hey everybody, what's going on? Jerome here, and today we have for you guys an awesome brand new game mode that I just kind of invented in Shellshock called Insanity Mode. Pretty much, I put it on 5 person free for all, put high wins on, 200 HP on, and, and now the game just kind of gets out of hand from there. Yeah, I, I literally, I don't know what I was thinking when I made this, but I know one thing. It's going to be absolutely, positively, insane Odrano. I played one practice round of it, and I'm like... Dear God, I've created a monster. So, I'm kind of excited. Oh! Look at that quick damage with an area strike. A quick and easy 60 damage. I feel so bad for that cheese onion guy. He just got destroyed in the first thingy. The, the game just started and he just got smacked around like that. Jeez, that is rough for him for sure. But what I'm going to do now is make it even tougher on him. Use a roller. I'm, I'm not giving up just yet on him. I got to make sure I take him clean out of the game or make it clear to him anyway. Yeah, there we go. I want to take out the closest player to me first. I feel like that might be the best strategy that I could possibly have. And oh my god, he's gunning for the teleporter right there. He wants out. He literally is like, get me the heck away from this crazed Baka. Get me away from him. But yeah, so this, this once again, is insanity mode. I don't know. Let me know if you want me to do more custom game modes, as well as try out some other ones as well. Someone was telling me like, Juggernaut's pretty fun. I, I, I don't know. I haven't played it yet. I don't even know what it is. But I feel like it could be a good time. Whoa. Oh, he's lucky. He got away just in time from that roller. Literally just in time for that roller to hit. Well, in the meantime... Oh, we gotta be careful now. We gotta be extra careful because this is some high winds going that direction. I don't know how much it's gonna carry it. So let's see. Hopefully this is the perfect amount. But I have a bad feeling with 78 mile per hour winds, this, this is probably gonna carry it way... Oh my god. Wow. Well, that carries it super far. Oh! Even though the cheese onion guy teleported, he's gone. And now, oh, now we're in the bad zone. Now we're in a really, really, really bad place. Uh, because, as you can probably tell, we're in the middle of this valley against all these other people. Fortunately, we're about to hit this and hopefully get some brand new weapons or armor. But other than that, though, we're in trouble. We're in trouble for insane mode. And, oh, my God. I cannot get this wind down right. But we got a spazzer. What do you think the spazzer does? All right, so it looks like it kind of goes in two different directions. We'll give, we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. We'll aim it kind of like that trajectory at this guy. Hopefully, it doesn't just split instantly and go in two directions. Like, hopefully, it's... What the heck? What did it even do? What a waste of an attack. It literally... I, I have no idea what that just did. But kind of aggravating. And at least the land got leveled again. That's always nice. Oh, this guy. This guy just ran right towards us. He's in our trap now. All right, let's go. Hit him with a snake. Oh, there we go. Only 20 damage, though. Dang it. That dang snake went the wrong direction on me. Could have went any direction. Instead, he just goes right there. All right, oh, there we go. Starting to, starting to get a little closer. All right, move only turn. Oh, man. Me and this guy are just going to blow each other apart to smithereens. I can already feel it. This is going to be bad, man. This is going to be bad. Here we go. Fire away, though! snake -a come on! Close my eyes! Oh! Ooh, that one did 30 damage. Oh, but we took some heavy. Yes! Luckily, the wind is on so that the, the bulger didn't actually hit us for all that potential damage. That's wonderful. What happens if we counter 3,000 someone from this close up? What do you guys think will happen? I actually don't know, because the counter 3,000 is one that kind of splits into a few... Oh! It literally just direct hits him a few times. Okay. Well, once again, it looks like I think Money Man might end up winning this one unless one of us gets some weird, crazy attack here because the situation we're in at the moment is not pretty for us. You know, we're stuck in the middle of this battle, this heated battle here. Oh, more weapons. What do we get? What do we get? Area Strike. Yes, 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 Saru. Okay, if we nail this just right and get lucky... This might be... That might be it for him. If we hit it right. Come on. No, we didn't get it just right. We didn't get it just right. We did good. Oh, no. Money Man's got two times damage. He's got two times damage. How's 46 health? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That guy. Not going to be able to take this guy out. Um, St. Colm. St. Colm. This will take him out of the game. But whether or not we'll survive till next round, I don't even want to see. I literally don't want to see. Oh, come on. Come on. Yes. All right. Well, at least he's out. He's definitely out. He survived. And oh my god. Yes. I don't know if he hit himself with that giant ball. The bounce explode or the bounce explode. Just wow. We just lucked out so hard on that one. All right. Well, 
I think this is definitely going to be the end of our friend Aru right there. Uh, and we got a roller left we can use on Money Man. Yeah, I kind of want to save the roller then. Let's just kill this guy off with like a solid flame or something. Let's see, what can we... What would do like the best like splash damage, I guess? Um, I guess let's just hit him with a Twinkler. Oh, oh this actually might be a little... This might be a little harder. He might survive! He might survive another round. He might survive just because I definitely didn't angle myself properly on this one. Alright, let's fire away. Let's see. Oh my god, the flame missed and we hit ourselves. No. So now this guy is definitely going to survive the next round. We're in trouble. We are in a lot, a lot of trouble now. Because we were trying to play strategically to kill Money Man next turn. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, let's back it up a bit. There we go. Let's try and uh, let's blooper this one in. Let's blooper this bad boy in. Okay, there we go. Blooper him in on him, and hopefully that'll kill him. Come on. Yes, he's dead. All right, we're clean in. We're clean. We've got five health left, and Money Man's right there. I mean, we can hit the armor. We could definitely hit that armor, and that might help. What could what could do this win for us? Oh, God, I don't think we have anything that can win this one for us right now. Um, all right, air strike. Let's get lucky. Let's get lucky with the placement here. Oh, and he took us clean out anyway. Well, hopefully we can do a little damage to him too at the end. No, we couldn't. GG's all around for the first round of Insanity Mode. We'll be right back with round two, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. Smash that like button once again if you're enjoying these. And share it around with your friends as well. I love making Shell Shock videos for you all. All right, everybody. So we're hopping in for a second round of Insanity Mode. I put it on Crater Valley here. Make it a little interesting because now everyone's going to spawn inside of a crater. So if you like lob a grenade in there or something or... Oh my god. This is going to be interesting. This is really interesting because they're all on that side of the map. I'm on this side of the map with Money Man over here. What a crazy kind of setup. And 87 mile an hour wins to start us off. Well, you know what? Just so we can get out of the pit first round, I'm actually just going to use Earthquake round one. Just so that it levels the playing field here and we can get the heck out of here. Let's see. Oh, jeez. We almost got hit with whatever that was. But let's see. Let's see. Come on. And the playing field has been leveled. So we got 40... 40 damage across the board. I mean, I'll take that. That's a good amount of damage. Uh, let's do... Let's do Horizon on somebody. All right, let's see. I'm sure, honestly, even though the wind is strong and I have no clue who this is going to hit, I'm sure this is going to hit somebody. Like, there's, there's no way that this is going to miss all of them. Actually, 71 mile an hour per wind is pretty harsh in this game. I'm, I'm used to not playing with wind, so we'll see. Oh! Yes! Looks like I called that one correctly because we hit that guy head on. And everyone over there is killing each other. And me and Money Man, it looks like, are almost, almost like we got an alliance or something going on here. That's funny how that's working out. Uh, okay, let's see. What could we do? We could builder it, but I don't think it's gonna... There's no chance that's gonna hit again in the same spot. So, chances are probably miss. We got Digger, too. You know what? Let's see. Maybe we can get a little lucky. I'm gonna use Twinkle. Although, I have a feeling it's gonna fall. Yeah, wait. Wow! It fell short! And they ended up hitting the other guy instead. Oh, we got dead weighted. Oh, jeez. Someone's in... We got someone on in our mark. Someone wants us dead. All right, let's use a roller. Get us out of trouble here. All right, let's see. We can we can honestly lob that. I think I think that'll do, right? That should definitely hit cheese on you. At least we'll do some damage that round instead of just not being able to do anything at all with that bump there. And I don't want to go after Money Man yet because we got something good going on here. Like a little, once again, like pseudo alliance. Oh, we got bumper skill shot plus five damage. Like a pseudo alliance going on that like I definitely don't want to ruin. Uh, because I'm the one stuck in a crater, and he's- Oh, no, he's moving in. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, well, maybe. Yeah, yeah, once again, I'm afraid of this. I am so afraid of this right here. Because he can just take us out. Alright, well, let's see what happens here. This is gonna be insane -o with the portals and the win- Yeah. Oh! But then it ended up- No way! So the portal ended up bouncing off the wall into the guy, and we killed him! What? The heck? Did that actually just happen there? Oh, no, this guy's right here. All right, he's right at our back door. We got no choice here. Let's just fire this up. Honestly, because the wind, this will hit him at least once or twice. It's not going to stay on him forever, though, unfortunately. Like, watch, ready? Hit him once, and then, yeah, the wind's just going to keep pushing it along. That's the best we honestly could have hoped for there, was doing that much. Oh, no. Oh, no, this is going to be bad. Hope I'm hoping Cheese Onion and Super Sand kill each other by this point, because, yeah, they're... Yeah, they're hopefully, hopefully be able to just kill each other. That's the big hope anyway. We'll see. We'll see if it actually comes to fruition. 
All right, builder time. Oh, no. I just realized. This might hit Money Man, and it might come back and hit us. I think we might shoot ourselves. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Now he's using Digger on us. Oh, no. So let alone hitting him, we didn't even... We hit ourselves, and he hit us with a Digger. That was a bad round for us. That was like a 50 damage round. Whew. That was close. All right, once again, Cheese Onion and the Super Guy there. Hopefully, are going to kill each other off. In case they don't, though, let's see if I can... What do you... Oh, what do you think? There's a few good ones here. What do you guys think? You know what? Let's use... Let's try and use Twinkler on this guy. There we go. Man, I like the wind. It just... It makes it that much more challenging, because you got to keep moving your trajectory ever. Oh, we nailed it head on right there, even with the wind. I like is you got to keep moving your trajectory every single round. You can't just keep the same exact everything. Like, for instance, if someone has a ruler like Sunday, they can't just keep using that against you. You know, it's it ain't gonna work out in their favor. Oh, geez, here we go. You know what? Let's raise this up a little bit in power. There we go, a little bit in power. All right, I don't know. That might be too much. We'll see banana time. Oh, man! If that banana hit him, that would have been so deadly. And looks like Super Sand ended up dying there. So it looks like it might be... Yeah, Cheese Onion's gonna get away with murder at this point. He's just gonna... Literally, no one's gonna even be able to go after him. All right, I don't know how Hoverball works, but I'm about to find out. Oh, really? That's what Hoverball does? I had the perfect trajectory on Money Man, and that's what it does. It basically does nothing. Okay. Let's see what- Oh, we can cactus this guy, probably. We probably- We could probably kill him with a cactus. A solid old cactus. Let's- Let's try. Let's try. We're gonna have to get a little bit lucky, though, because the wind. Hopefully, it's not too much. I hope I didn't put too much pressure on this one. Come on. Come on. We have the most health out of anyone, but we're also squeezed in between two people. And looking at the way Cheese Onion has his cannon aimed, I'd say he's probably aiming at me. And Money Man, I think I- It's pretty clear at this point we're in a war, me and him. Oh! A war that he might not be able to win. A war that he might not be able to win indeed. Okay, well, let me just... I'm just gonna go ahead and do the same thing, actually, there. Because we got another cactus. I can... Yeah, I might be able to kill him with this cactus hit here. Oh, that'd be epic. That'd be so, so epic. He's got 27 health, unfortunately. So, a roller won't kill him this round. So, we rolled in. Wouldn't do the trick. What we can do, though, if we kill him with this cactus, let's see. Yes, sirree. Now we can use the roller and an earthquake on Cheese Onion. And now we have a guaranteed uh, 30. Oh, my God. Is that, like, the max level of Digger? That thing is humongous. That is honestly so terrifying. It must be, like, double damage or something. Why do I have a bounty on my head? What does that even mean? I didn't even know this game had. I mean, I've seen bounties before, but what does that mean? Does that mean someone wanted to put a bounty on my head? Or does that mean does it naturally ha I, I have no idea. Okay, because the wind is so bad in my favor, this one, I'm going to save any good attacks we have for later and just use, yeah, a quick roller there to ensure that we do the damage. There we go. Tame kind of wins is perfect because now we can use Horizon right... Oh, my God, and he moved right into our field of vision right there. Horizon time. Come on. Take him out. This might kill him. This might kill him. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Yes. No, it didn't kill him. 24 health left. Oh, he's still in this thing to win it. He's still in it. Well, at least we have the guaranteed 10 damage we can use at any point in time. Um, let's go ahead and let's palm tree him, I guess. Oh my god, there's 94 speed. Honestly, 94, I don't even trust myself to hit him. I just used Earthquake, and wow, look at that! He hit us with the digger for only one attack, but then it started blowing away because the wind is so powerful. All right, here we go, here we go. Anything at all that just scatters shots, and I'm pretty sure that'd be game on this guy. Yeah, flame. I'm just gonna flame on him. There we go. Alright. Kinda just flame right there. Come on. At least hit with like one or two. Yes! And the flame was enough to kill him, and that's going to secure a big victory for our second round of Insane Mode ever. So we're gonna be right back, everybody, with the third and final round of Insanity Mode. Wish me luck, because it literally is exactly as it sounds. It's crazy. It's insane. It, it, it's genuinely insane Odrain. All right, everybody, we're loading up the third and final round for Shell Shock Insanity Mode, and oh my god. I mean, I chose the map, but of course on this map, we have to take the center, don't we? Uh, well, I, I'm gonna go ahead and just fire an Earthquake just to kind of settle the playing field here, because it, it's a very rocky start, and plus, I mean, while there's still four people left, a nice Earthquake does 40 total damage. I mean, that's, that's not bad. 
That's actually really dang good. So let's go ahead. We'll use a nice old earthquake. And oh, that guy just got rejected by his own thing. And wow, all in all, not bad. We survived the entire thing. And actually looking at the stats, that earthquake we did, did more damage than anyone else. So technically speaking, we actually had a pretty dang good turn. Not gonna lie. All right, here, let's see if we can nail this static effect here. Now the wind is not in our favor for this shot. So I kind of did it really weak as well. I, I don't know if it's going to backfire. Please don't backfire. Please don't. I, I hope it doesn't backfire. I really hope it doesn't. But we'll see in a second here. Come on, nail Super Saiyan. Just nail him with one. If I, can, if I can get this trajectory right on him, I did. Yes. That is exactly what we needed. That is precisely, precisely what we needed there. And unfortunately, though, we got hit with something, which means we got pushed down a hole and we have to refine the trajectory. But at least we did 25 damage. Not bad. Wow, some people did a lot more damage than that, though. Okay, let's do Horizon. Hor can we... Oh, the Horizon. Uh-oh. This is going to be tough. It's going to be tough. All right, here we go. Let's try and limp it over on a Super Saiyan. I hope we can hit this one again. This one, the wind is in our favor, so I didn't even weaker. Yes, it was good enough. All right, perfect. Nailed him for 30, and we flattened the landscape. So now we're... Oh, no. But we just got flattened even further. We must be in someone's line of sights here. We have to be in someone's line of sights, because this is not pretty by any means for us. All right, let's... I just kind of moved over a little bit here. Oh, my God. 45-degree winds. All right, let's hope that hits. Honestly, I hope that hits because it, I did a good angle, but 45-degree. That's what I'm saying. I put the winds on high. This is crazy. This is insane mode. Literally insane mode in every way, shape, and form. I don't even know what to do. I don't know what to do. All right, come on. Turn four, eight, seven. Oh, we nailed it right on target. 45 damage. Don't mind if I take... Whoa, what the heck? What is that thing? I don't know what that is, but I don't trust it. And Super Saiyan is about to take out... Wow. Cheese Honey did 71 damage that turn, but Super Saiyan is about to take out Money Man for us. Pretty quickly, too. Oh, no. Oh, no. This guy, he's got us right in our sights. Okay, well, we got to choose an attack then. That'll just take him to the clinic. What happens if we banana him from this close up? Is that... Does that matter? Will it not engage the banana? It went right through him. We just wasted a perfectly good turn, unfortunately. That is really unfortunate for us. And whoa, look at that! That guy just got saved by, by from an airstrike from a portal. And then that, lo and behold, ended up just almost hitting the guy next to him. Well, that's kind of funny, actually, how that all worked out there. All right, well, Twinkler, hit Super Saiyan, come on. And yes, Super Saiyan laid off for a second. Good, because one more hit from him and we'd probably be dead. We only have 58 health left. All right, Super Saiyan... Hopefully you take out Money Man here, and then I can take you out in two turns, Super Saiyan, and then I'm hidden off to the side. Yes! 40 damage? Are you kidding me? That's epic. Oh my god, no, no, no. One of those balls is that, that ball's gonna hit us. The ball's gonna hit us. Dead on. I don't know what attack that was, but dang, that got us good. Um, oh my god. A solid lob grenade right in here could be the end of this guy. Let's see, let's see. All right. Yeah, that's gonna be right in. That's gonna be right in the pocket. That's going to end him. The question is, am I going to be ended first? I don't know. At least Super Saiyan will be dead too, so we might not get last place technically. Oh my god, we survived. Whatever Super Saiyan did, we survived. And then we took him out with a grenade. Yes! And now Money Man is also super hit with 20, 20 health left. Do we... Oh, uh, hopefully, hopefully we get a roller suit. We can just take Money Man clean out of the game. Wow, 86 mile an hour wins against us here. Well, I don't know how well this is going to work out for us. Hopefully, if we hit that static on Cheese Onion, I have a feeling he's close enough to Blue Guy that it might just end up doing 25 to the next. Oh my god. Even with 86 wind against us, we just overshot that like no tomorrow. All right, give us a new weapon. Give us a roller. One solid roll. Oh my god. It, as soon as I said that, the attack landed right on us. Are you kidding me? What did we get from that? Snowball and 15 armor. Well, we definitely, definitely needed that, but that was 100%. You know, unnecessary. That was... Okay. Oh, my God. We overshot it again. No. We have one HP left. Oh, my God. And we didn't get new attacks yet. We didn't get new attacks yet. This is bad. What is... I don't know what a snowball does, but it's our last hope. I have a bad feeling about this, though, I think. You know what? We did win last round, at least, but I just have a bad feeling. I think we lost this one. All right. Come on, snowball. Land the attack. I don't know what you do. Oh, my God. It bounces? 
Well, either way, oh, it gets bigger and bigger. It bounces, it gets bigger and bigger. But unfortunately, we ended up dying there. And that is going to do it, my friends. I hope you all enjoyed this epic episode of Insane Mode on Shell Shock. If you did, click that like button, subscribe if you have not done so already, and suggest new game modes down below in the description. Take care.